Hey guys, it's your boy, the history teacher. I'm back and I'm here with Jaden and Ariana. And guess what else is back? Dumb McCrib. Wait, this, this is not new. This is. Well, this is not new. Yeah, this is. This McDonald's likes to uh, bring this back every once in a while. Actually, a little history on the McCrib. The first time McDonald's rolled it out, 1981. Huh? Yeah, and then they go away with it for a little while, and then they bring it back, and then, you know, and, and now it's back. McDonald's is this cuckoo. Yeah, a little bit, yeah. And now it's back, you know, for a limited time only, so we're going to go ahead and try it. But remember, this is part one of the video. Part two, I'm going to make my own McRib. Wait, what? And these eyes are going to try it. Huh? No, yeah. no, no, no. Well, whatever. I'm gonna make my own McRib and they're gonna try it or I'm gonna try it. Don't touch that. Somebody's gonna try it. And just in case you guys are wondering why um, the elves are here, um, we cannot touch them. This morning they ended up uh, on the dining table uh, on, on the tree. On the yeah. They ran a little experiment with the Skittles. They're well, all melted now. Oh, you did. Yeah. Okay. They had the but what did you What did you do? So we had to put water and then the Skittles turned rainbow. Rainbow. Wow. That's awesome. So if you can't see me too well because I'm behind this big Christmas tree, um, but pretty sure you can see my head. Can't really touch the elves. Their magic is going to go away if we do. Um, and, you know, they call them elves on an elf on a shelf. Uh, they don't spend a lot of time on a shelf. Uh, I don't know why they call them that. But hey, the thing I wanted to do before we even get into this McCrib tasting, I was looking over on the internet and I saw a bunch of reviews and I thought some of them were funny. Uh, I don't even know when they're from, um, some of them maybe 10 years ago, but here's one right here from a guy, uh, it says, I had one when I was visiting my cousin in Texas. So this guy's from Canada, I guess, guy or girl. Um, it was the last day and we're about to board an airplane. When I decided to go for a walk, I saw the McDonald's. Obviously you saw McDonald's because they're on every corner. So I'm not surprised you saw McDonald's. Um, but he saw the McRib, all right? Something you never see in Canada. So I'm not sure, all the Canadian friends out there, is there a McRib in Canada? I don't even know if there's, well, there is a McDonald's, I've been in Canada. But, so he figured while in Texas, he ordered up the McRib so he could try it. It was the best tasting fast food thing he's ever had, all right? I'm sold on it right there, all right? I know there was a guy uh, commented back said, I think I'm sold, I'm sold too, all right? You know, let's, uh, another one, yes, yes, yes. A thousand times yes. Mind you, I've never tried this sandwich. It's been around for over, since 1981. I've never tried it. You, Obviously, Dave you, never you, tried you, it. You still haven't tried it? Never. This is going to be my first time trying it. Oh, oh I know. Um, and, and here's another guy that said, you're going to get two answers here. Oh, sweet Jesus, I'm going to buy five right now. Wow. And... Well, I'm not going to get into that last one. Not very appropriate. Um, but there's another one. Put it this way. McDonald's has to slather barbecue sauce all over it to sell it. What? I like barbecue sauce. I don't know yeah. if you guys like barbecue sauce, really but, like barbecue you know. Anyways, let's get away from what these guys are talking about. And let's get into the tasting. Let's open it up. See what it looks like. Ew, 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 and... Oh wow, you. mine definitely does have a lot of barbecue sauce on it. It was kind of stuck to it. You, I got there it is. Oh, mine almost fell. Yeah. I can't even. Here it is. Looks really slathered with barbecue sauce. Why do they put so much barbecue sauce? I have no this idea. Is Here, this napkin is for why you. They have to make like a da trillion napkins. Trillion napkins. Trillion. Yeah, oh, Dallas doesn't give you that many napkins either. You know what? Let's try to pick this thing up and eat it. I got it. So we can see what we Ooh, think about so it. Good. Oh, it smells really good, actually. It smells like barbecue or something. Mm. Actually, mm -hmm. I'm in a second bite. Second bite, huh? I don't know what I think. I know what I think. What do you think? Wait, Two I thumbs down? Yeah. Half thumb? All right, we'll get a half thumb from Mariana. What about you? No? 
Not at all. Oh, he's got two thumbs down. One of them's got barbecue no. sauce all over it. Well, actually, actually, it was kind of good. Kind of kind good. Of kind of. So what does that mean? What are we doing here? Middle thumb. Middle thumb. So half a thumb from Ariana. I'm gonna give it two thumbs down. This is definitely not worth the hype. Um, and and like one of those guys said on, on online, they they sure did slather it in in barbecue sauce. Probably a, a tub per sandwich. Um, so there you have it. Half a thumb for the McRib for McDonald's is back. Oh, zero. I'm not even giving it anything. I'm not, you know, I, the bread tastes pretty good. Yeah, it's, it's pretty good, good tasting. Yeah. Hey, but listen, this is only part one. Part two, I'm gonna make my own McRib at home, and we're gonna try that one and compare it to this one. No, you're not. Guarantee you right now, it's gonna get more than half a thumb up, um, and I'm gonna try to use a little bit less um, barbecue sauce. Um, so anyways, there you guys have it. The McCrib, half a thumb up. Make sure you guys follow, subscribe, hit the bell, hit a like, leave a comment. Hey, we haven't done food tasting in a little while. I haven't. Comments. Yeah, well, 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 comments. yeah, we haven't had comments. Hey, come on guys. I mean, you, you know, it takes, takes a few things. Okay. Hi, how are you? You know, I mean, you're shooting me texts left and right, you know, leave some comments on YouTube. Um, but yeah, there you have it. Uh, the McRib, half a thumb up. We appreciate you guys are subscribed. They're liking the videos. Those that you haven't subscribed, like the videos. We've got more videos to come. If you guys are into car reviews, we got a lot more lined up for you. I know we did too. Wait. And you guys are really liking those. And uh, we're going to do Wait, more. What? There's more car reviews. I thought we only I'm going to think. Well, I'm going to buy two more cars and then with those, those two. And then we'll trade them in and we'll work it like that, right? Bye. Right. All right, we'll see you guys next time on AMA Live. Oh, no. You guys are missing out. You said you didn't like it. I didn't. I'm hungry. I'm no. It's going to do, I guess. I'm real hungry. Mm. Mm. Um, I mean, maybe it's an acquired taste.